Okay, epic video game fire making skills that wouldn't work in real life. Very good. Alright, now let's eat that chili and start shitting. Let me take a look at you, kid. Jesus. He could have killed you. The fuck is wrong with him? You're up. Kenny's out back, trying to get some stupid truck started. Here, you should eat something. Not that, don't eat chili. Oh my god, you'll be shitting for weeks. Kidding? Okay. The zombies will follow the trail of diarrhea. Thank you. Now fuck you. Thank you. But fuck you. <laughs> I can't believe he's gone. I've lost people before, but it just hasn't felt this this shitty in a while. He was a great guy. Hmm. God damn. I'm glad you did. I'm gonna find something to clean that up. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, uh mistranslation. Take this Fuck, you. Fuck you. Fuck <laughs> you. Feeling better? Yeah. <clears throat> Hell of a day. But we gotta get moving. If you're feeling up to it, I could use a hand out back with this truck. This house ain't worth the crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. With a little luck, we can get one fixed up. Be out of here by nightfall. Really? Now? Look, Clem, I know <clears throat> we're all hurting. But I need your help here. Okay? Hmm. I'll wait for you out back. I'll watch him. Can you really get a truck started? Fine. I don't know. This doesn't sound right. It sounds fishy. Just be careful. Yeah, something weird's going on. I don't think Kenny has any intention of actually getting a truck started. Something else is happening here. Maybe he's going to try to leave with Clem. What did she have to say? I know she was running her mouth. What did she say? Well, we didn't talk about you. Really? Really, Kenny. <sighs> what happened? It's over. But AJ needs us now. We gotta stick together on this thing, alright? Come on. Let's see if the truck's gonna go. He always had a half dozen wrecks he was fixing up. He was a mean some bitch, but he taught me respect. Girl like Jane could learn a thing or two about that. I like her. Just give her some time. Maybe you're right. <laughs> Hell, Talk I sense. didn't know what to make of Lee at first. That's right. Of course, he helped me and mine more times than I can remember. Jane helped us back on the road. All right, give it a turn. All right, what am I doing here? Turn the key. Nothing. Dead. We're so close, Clem. With a little bit of luck, I can get this thing running. And then we can get out on the road and really make some distance. And go where? Wellington's gotta be out there. Now, those rumors can't all be bunk. I mean, hell, there's gotta be something out here other than snow and goddamn Euro trash. 
What Mexico. about Mexico? Yeah, right there. Why? You want a taco? I've never been there. I went once, long time ago, just before I met Ken. Oh. All right, turn it again. All right, try again. Here's the old special feeling touch. Here we go, and magic. Did you turn it? Yes. God damn it! Fuck. Well, <sighs> magic touch ain't worth a shit. We'll get it working. We gotta get moving if we're gonna keep AJ alive. We're running out of time. I gotta get this thing to start. Gonna try warming up the battery. Go on inside. I don't like leaving him with that girl. She goes inside and everyone's dead but Arvo. <laughs> That'll be something, huh? Everyone's fucking dead somehow. Need any help? I'm fine. Go check on AJ. All right, he doesn't want to talk. We got an excavator. We've got some kind of a battery thing over here. Obviously, we've got Bonnie. We'll talk to her in a minute. Does this work? Nope. Busted. I see a cord hanging right here. What is this? Look at the house. It looks like it's about to collapse. Huh. That must have been something. Under construction during the zombie apocalypse, right? What are the chances? Finally scrounged together enough money to build my dream home. And that's when the zombies showed up. What a bunch of dicks. Wish they'd finished this place. Or left a fucking working battery on one of these things, but then again, how long has it been? A year or two? You know? Alright, let's see what Bonnie has to say. What do you want? I'm sorry about Luke. Sorry. It must be nice being a pretty little girl. No one ever expects you to do a damn thing. Wow, what a bitch. She did what Luke wanted. You and I both know you had a chance to save Luke. You and I both know what happened back there. I got nothing more to say to you. Wow. You are a bitch. You know, you did exactly what Luke told you to do. That is fucking stupid as hell. You know what? Chase that bitch. Go tell her your true feelings. Gingers never prosper. Gingers are fucking waste of life. Don't tell her. <laughs> oh, I can't. Damn it. She's gone. God damn it. That is my freaking fault. How dare you. Alright, what's going on in here? There's the baby. And Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved him in here. God damn it! <laughs> Seen that look before. Son of a bitch! I've seen it too. A few times. Then you know what's about to happen. Hmm. I know Kenny's a nice guy, Clem. Like a keg of kettle pop like that boiling over. Was a nice guy too, once. Probably had a nice job and a nice pretty wife. But then all this happened. And one day he caved some kid's face in and realized he could sleep at night. Hmm. 